Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're looking at a battery tracker that will graph your battery, show whether your uh, voltage is dropping, and monitor your battery. You can remotely monitor it while you're inside the house. I can get a signal probably in two rooms into my house so you don't even have to go outside and open your hood. Let's have a look at it right now. So this battery tracker is from Anti-Gravity. It's got a Bluetooth 4.0. It'll monitor your voltage starting and cranking system with your phone. It just amounts to connecting one terminal to your battery. Mount that little box. One terminal to your positive battery cable. And download the app. You can read that bar graph right there. This is my initial voltmeter reading. 12.64. I was running the car recently, so... I was charging it up because it was down to about 12.2. So I want to monitor this battery voltage and see how it goes. So we are showing the battery at 8% even though the static voltage is at 12.69. I'm going to turn on the headlights here. See what it says. Okay, so battery voltage is dropping to 12.55. Twelve point five. Now, what doesn't make any sense is why it would say nine percent. The battery at twelve point six is a hundred percent charged. So I don't know about this algorithm. So I'm gonna turn the headlights off. That's the surface charge, and we'll see what it goes back to off. Okay, went back up to twelve five. Let me start the car. Okay, the car is started, and we're putting out 14.5 volts. 14.57 to be exact. And the vehicle is charging. So I'm going to shut off the car now. See what this... This icon, see how it shows that battery just dropped down to 10%. Makes no sense unless the algorithm is smarter than that static battery voltage. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to leave it run for a while. So I ran the vehicle for an hour. I'm going to turn it off now and let's see what the algorithm says about the battery capacity. Well, this time the algorithm says 100%. So that algorithm is smarter than just the uh, static battery voltage. Let me turn the headlights on and we'll see if we can run some of this surface voltage down. 12.65 and that 100% is rock steady not showing any drop at all even though the voltage is similar to what it was before the algorithm has uh, come around to uh, be full so we're looking at 99% now and I'll have to check it overnight see how it goes Still got the headlights on. Let's turn the headlights off. Okay, the headlights are off and the static voltage is going back up. Dome lights are going off. And we are at 12.7. And the algorithm for the uh, battery capacity is still sitting at 99%. 12.8. Twelve point eight three. Well, I'll follow up this with this tomorrow and see what this battery capacity says and how the algorithm works out. But so far, I'm very pleased with this meter. Well, guys, I hope this video has helped you out. I would appreciate it if you'd hit like and uh, and subscribe and. 
This kind of uh, battery monitoring can help out with the modern day cars because there's, there's 20 to 30 different modules on smart cars nowadays. And some of them call home and do software updates. Sometimes it's like leaving your phone off the hook, the module doesn't hang up and it goes offline and it just sits there and runs your battery down. Now this monitor will, this battery tracker has a graph and it'll show like at three o'clock in the morning that the battery started dropping and say, it runs dead at four o'clock in the morning, you'll be able to say, I know exactly when it started, you know, to, to weed out whether, you know, you think you left the headlights on or you left something on or if the car turned something on, especially with these electric cars that you plug in like mine, there's known concerns that they possibly run the battery down when they are plugged in after the battery is fully charged, the, after the high voltage battery is fully charged that some modules don't go to sleep and they might run the battery down. So I will be tracking that on my plug-in hybrid and I will be able to at least graph when, say in the middle of the night that the battery started dropping for no apparent reason. And we'll know whether it was some sort of, we won't know what module caused it, but at least you'll be able to see when it happened. So please hit like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one.